Hey everyone, this is part two of my Xbox review. So this is what you've recently done. Or recently used, my bad. I play Star Wars Battlefront 2 a lot, I really enjoy that game. Call of Duty Black Ops 6, I think that's coming to Game Pass. This is... Central Xbox Nudes. Special Club. I think these are the achievements. I don't play Halo as much anymore. In fact, I haven't played Halo in a while. I don't know why that is. Probably because I'm playing Battlefront 2 right now. Minecraft, Halo 5, Star Wars Battlefront 2. Friends and Community. You can share something. Games we picked for you. I never played Jedi Survivor. I heard that it's hard. Deals. I am video taping this on my phone. Grand Theft Auto 5. I don't play Grand Theft Auto. Well, I think I played Grand Theft Auto once when I was a kid when I couldn't help. So sorry about that. And then this is other stuff, like ads for games. Watch, it says watch and listen. Then you have more games, more games. Let's talk about Game Pass. So this is Game Pass, it's a subscription service. Play later, perks, deals. So they're all. I think coming to Game Pass shows you the new games. Gotham Knights. I've never played that. Tell me in the comments if you like Gotham Knights, and I might play it. I, tell me if it's harder or not. But I always thought the Arkham games were really hard. Picks for you. Day one releases, Starfield. I never played Starfield. I don't know why people are hating on the game, but I never played it, so I don't know what. I can't give you an opinion on it. Family and kids. Now we go to the store. And this is the store. So you have your deals, subscriptions. I think you can also get rewards points. To buy stuff. I don't know how to redeem my rewards though. Can someone teach me how? So that me and my dad can do it. Indiana Jones. That's movies. I don't know how. If people like the classic. Edition of the. Ooh Hogwarts Legacy. I've never played that. This is. Add on for you. There's so much on this Xbox. It's weird. My genre. Movies. Add on apps home. Entertainment apps. Apps for gamers. Hardware. Just said the Xbox console. That's like controllers. That's what that does. This is the best Xbox in history of Xbox. I love what they did. Not to redeem, which I don't know how they do. I don't know how to do. They said I had a gift card, and I don't know. That's Game Pass, Church Bar, Settings. That's what this is. If you want to go back, you just press B. Um. Personalization, my color. You can even use your screenshot as background, which is cool. I'm using this one.
They need to make a Dark Valorant. I like these ones a lot. I love this one. Okay. And that's just general stuff. Sorry if the camera is like everywhere. I'm doing it on my phone. My subscriptions, my account. You just press A to enter stuff. Pay online customized profile. You can change your picture. I chose the astronaut because I'm a huge space fan. It's probably why I'm interested in Star Wars so much. So you have social activity feed following. Shows your gamer score. Shows you how many rewards points you have. It shows the achievement leaderboard. I am currently sorry. There's the rewards points. I don't know how to use them very well. That's my gamer tag. So if you have any questions, you can just text me on that. Send me a message on the Xbox. And my profile. I already said yet. And that is pretty much everything that you get on your Xbox Series X. And then you have the browser store button right here, which is cool. If I were to, this is a 12 teraflop 4K Ultra AC console. Four, ter, 12 teraflops actually. 12 teraflops, 4K resolution. So many cool features. If you are an Xbox fan, upgrade to this console. This console, I believe, is 349. Wait. This console is like $349 on certain websites. So it's a great deal. You're getting so much included with the Xbox Series X. My favorite game right now is Battlefront 2. I play Shadow of the Tomb Raider. I really enjoy that one. But I don't know where to go. Shadow of the Tomb Raider is hard to find out where to go. That is the ultimate Xbox Series Extra review. This is part two of the review. The user interface. I love the new UI. Microsoft did a great job. So thank you, Microsoft. I love my Xbox Series X. And next gen Xbox comes out and it's a console with the disk drive, I will get it. If it if it's digital only, I'll still get it. If it's like a console, I don't really want a handheld.